UConn fans, listen up. Your mascot, Jonathan the Husky, is in the spotlight. Take a look at these adorable bobbleheads of Jonathan 14 and Jonathan 15. They're the current and recently retired UConn mascots. Now, they were just released today. The National Bobblehead Hall of Fame created 50 new bobbleheads for National Bobblehead Day. That is Sunday, January 7th. Just a great way to show your school spirit uh, for whether you're a, a fan, an alumni, current student, faculty, staff, bobbleheads are just a perfect way to celebrate that uh, affinity for your favorite school. The Hall of Fame Museum produced its first college mascot bobblehead back in 2015. Co-founder Phil Sculler says this year they had a list of live mascots they wanted to do, and Jonathan there made the list. The Jonathan bobbleheads will be behind me in the museum when they come in and a growing list of uh, live mascots. We just unveiled the bobblehead of uh, LSU's Mike the Tiger today. We've been Memphis, a lot of different uh, Bulldogs and the Saluki from Southern Illinois. So it'll be a, a really cool collection once it uh, continues to develop. And uh, Jonathan, both Jonathans will make great additions to that uh, collection. It'll be seen by tens of thousands of visitors each year at the museum. Seen and appreciated. Sculler says a lot of attention went into creating these likenesses of the two Jonathans in the keepsakes. We based the bobbleheads off two sort of iconic pictures of uh, both Jonathan dogs. Uh, Jonathan the 14th, uh, he was in a standing pose on the Yukon logo base with his name on the front of the base. And there's a picture of him uh, that just really caught our attention and uh, is seen you know, in a lot of different spots of him just standing and with his gaze and uh, as a proud husky. And so that we use that one for Jonathan the 14th. And then there's a picture of Jonathan the 15th with his puppy eye. There are only a little over 2,000 available in each version because they are a limited edition. You can pre-order them for 30 bucks each and they are expected to ship in April.